when you are training uh, fighters like Mikey Garcia and y'all have to do an open media workout, you're in a place you haven't been before, or maybe you're not used to this gym and you, there are certain things that they don't have here to go with your regimen of training or getting a fighter prepared, what do you do in a situation? Like say they don't have a, a, a piece of equipment that you need. Well, usually when you when we do start a camp or I start a camp, I start I don't include the fight week. Fight week for me is a recovery week. So I try to do as little as possible on the week. It's just really just a about just letting the fighter rest, let him recover, focusing on just the diet and the, and the weight for the weight. So it, it doesn't matter what's around. I mean, you, you can do whatever I want. You can do just like on a little dirt track around here, just, you know, some jogging. Or you could just go to any health club, gym, bike, stuff like that. So what I do on fight week is just really so limited. And it's every other day besides that. So by the time we get here on fight week, the work is already done. There's nothing left to do. And that's really how it's supposed to be. It may not always be like that, but uh, that's just that's that's how I plan it to where it's it's just supposed to be the last 10 days about recovery. Okay, cool. Why, why was Aram so uh, forward with getting you out of his top fighters camps? Like, you know, you if really you... have to, we have to ask him. Is he gonna be here? <laughs> because I would. Huh? Is he gonna be here? <laughs> I don't know, but you know, that's you know, I can't, I can't focus on things like that. Yeah. You know, there's, there's other fighters out there, you know, and, right. and, uh, like promoters and others, things like that. So, yeah. And if you keep getting hired by these other guys, I mean, there's got to be some, some, some good behind what you're doing. So it's just kind of, I was just, just wondering myself because yeah. it's, you know, man, it's like anything else. There's some people that are gonna love your work. There's some people that are not gonna love your work. They're really gonna like you or not like you. I'm just very fortunate that I've worked with a lot of guys. I've had some really tremendous results with the program. I have a great team behind me with, with Terry Tom as my uh, registered sports dietitian. That's worked with now with who started with me with Manny. Worked with Amir Khan. Who worked with Chavez Jr. With Linares. That's worked with Mel Mikey. With Brandon. Now with my Donna. So she has a tremendous amount of experience just working in boxing, working with 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 uh, top level fighters. Not to mention all the other athletes that she has. So together, you know, we're able to sit there, work together, brainstorm together, plan out these things so that we're not playing a guessing game through camp. That we're doing things very meticulous and very scheduled and planned out. So uh, we're trying not, we're trying to make it as, make sure that there's as few as mistakes as possible. So that uh, some of the things that has happened to these guys with making weight, trying to make weight, don't, it doesn't happen again. So, you know, again, sometimes, you know, the, whatever the personality differences are, um, as, as long as you're getting hired for your work, that's what's important. Do you still talk to Manny and, I mean, all, all the guys that you used to train? And I t No, Manny I don't speak with, I haven't spoken with, but uh, everybody else, yeah, I still talk with everybody. Mir Khan, just a couple weeks ago. You know, we're all still friends. Whatever the reasons we don't work out, you don't work out, like, you know, every... Every marriage isn't made in heaven, but uh, you do you do the best work that you can, and, and you hope that you get good, great, uh, positive results. And the fighters feel comfortable in what they're doing. They feel confident. They have they feel secure in what you're doing. And, and when that happens, it makes everything flow for them, and, and they get to concentrate on just boxing. And, uh, 